my lovely wishes, it's Holly. Welcome to Dandelion Stitches. How are you? Is everything good? I, I'm thinking of all of you. I am sending super big hugs and wishes for as good as it can be. Because sometimes that's all you can hope for. So, um, yeah, it's Tuesday. And so it's breathing day. And uh, it's also, I'm going to show you some really good fabric day. Uh, I don't know if you remember, but I told you that I went a little crazy at laundry basket quilts and um, I got three of these bundles and I am crazy for them. I've not even taken them out of the bag, so we will be looking at them kind of together. So and there will be a giveaway, not the fabric, <laughs> not the fabric, but there will be a giveaway at the end. So uh, let's begin with some breaths. Nobody um, ever commented on how you would like to breathe. So uh, we're just gonna go with the straightforward, we're gonna do five breaths. And uh, in those breaths, we're going to breathe in love, joy, gratefulness, positivity, acceptance, you know, all the, all the good, all the good, um, adjective, are they? We're gonna call them action words. We're gonna call them verbs. Uh, because I think that most of them involve a, a certain amount of action on our parts to be loving and to be kind and to be grateful. And um, so that's what we're going to do. So uh, you're going to want to get comfortable, sit up as straight as you are able and comfortable at the same time. Um, we're going to take a deep cleansing breath. We're going to do five breaths and then another deep cleansing breath and um and hopefully it will send out some goodness into the world so get comfortable deep cleansing breath and five breaths breathe at your pace Relax your shoulders. Relax your jaw. Deep cleansing breath. Blow it out. Thank you, friends. If you are finding, and I know I, that could have been four, that could have been six, it could have been ten breaths. I don't. I stop counting. I just breathe. Um, if you are finding that your mind immediately starts to go somewhere else, you can repeat the word in your head that you are most wanting to send out. You could just keep repeating love, 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 joy, joy, joy. Give your give your brain a place to go. I also had somebody say to me, is it normal when you are, are breathing like this to have some emotion come forward? And it is absolutely normal especially if you're going to be meditating in a longer period of time um you you will sometimes I just cry I don't know why it just it brings up certain emotions that I think we just have to deal with and uh, it gives us a safe place to express those emotions so um if you're finding that you get a, a little emotional while you're breathing normal and good and really good so let's switch to the other camera and look at some pretty fabric. Okay, so these are the, <clears throat> sorry, we're gonna be doing that again. Um, these are from Laundry Basket Quilts and these are, they're calling them the fabric kit. And they are 12 quarter yards. Um, and they're broken up into the first one here is fall, this one is red and this one is blue and there are more. And each one is 
So I ordered them because I thought I did not care for this kind of fabric. Uh, as it turns out, <laughs> I do. Uh, quite a lot, actually. So I wanted to just build up a little stash, and I thought this would be a good way to do that. Plus, if you find one in here that, I, if I, that oh, I really love this, then I can set it aside and maybe go get some yardage of it or whatever. But we're going to start with fall. Come on now. This is my favorite one. Surprise. <laughs> I am not going to open them all the way out, but I will, um, well, we'll do this. Pretty, pretty little kind of ditzy, not, not really ditzy. Now this, this is a surprise. I was, I was not expecting tigers. No leopards. No, I don't know. That is definitely a surprise. Oh, this is Robert Kaufman. So I guess it's everything is maybe not laundry basket. Hmm. Surprise. Pretty. This one is kind of a um almost a minty green and and it's brown. The decorations are brown. Love it. Love this one. Look at it with this plaid. That's so cool. Just out of curiosity. This is Andover. That's also beautiful. Wouldn't this be a pretty, pretty fall pillow, pretty fall, pretty fall anything? I am digging these. Oof, gosh. And then add this one to the bunch. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is the oats and the wheats because mares eat oats and does eat oats and little lambs eat ivy. <laughs> Thank you for all the help on that one, by the way. Everyone, many, many, many of you shared. Okay, so uh, Laundry Basket Quilts is from Andover. Andover is there. Oh, look at that. <gasps> oh. Can a person make a quilt with quarter in? Yeah, of course you can make a quilt with quarter yard. Oh, okay. So these like right here, these I'm not, I'm not jiving on these. Oh my goodness. I love this one. Let's see what happens if I put these back on the top. It's these two that I don't. This one I do like. Okay, so that's fall. Now I am assuming, which of course is never a good idea, that um, you probably would not get the exact same fabrics that I'm getting. But <clears throat> assumptions. Not a good idea. Okay. Pretty little dot. And it is blue, maybe three colors of blue. It's like blue, gray. It's not just a blue dot. This is lovely. You're going to get real tired of listening to me say, look how lovely these are. Look at how pretty that is. That is so pretty. <sighs> I 
This is her, I think her linen line, her linen something. I love these. The um that linen look to them. They're not they're cotton, but they have that linen look. Oh, I love these. These little buds. Oops, upside down. Kind of rose hip yeah, rose hips. Cause the twigs look like they have thorns. So pretty. These remind me so much. I used to, we live just north of Rockford, Illinois. And in Rockford, there's a, <clears throat> a historic home called Tinkerswiss Cottage. And many years ago, I used to volunteer as a docent. And um, I also, they trained me to clean uh, historical homes. So I would also go in and dust and clean and do all that stuff. And um, <clears throat> they're bringing, they've done this several times, but they're bringing in, uh, I, th I believe at this time it's Jack Osborne and I don't even, I don't know who, but anyway, um, to do like a haunted, is this house haunted kind of thing. And, um, and, I, and I'm here to tell you what it is haunted. And I know you're probably all thinking, mm, she's a little crazy. There is no such thing. Uh, there is. <laughs> I would never in a hundred million zigamigazillion years uh, a, 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 like agree if I had not experienced it. Blue, gorgeous. So every single one of these, just gorgeous. Um, but I have been in that building alone and I have... There have been footsteps on other floors or, or in other rooms. I go to check. There's nobody there. If that wasn't uh, enough, uh, I, I started talking to whoever I, who I thought it was. And um, I swear, I swear, this is beautiful, by the way. I swear by that also. Things would start to move in the room. Uh, at one point, a large paperweight just flew off a desk onto the floor. And, uh, ooh, look at that. That could, that could almost be a dandelion. Um, yeah, stuff like that happened. Uh, I would go in a room and clean it and put things where I thought they would need to be. And I would go back in the room later and things would be all moved around. So apparently, whoever it was did not like the way I put things together. So, <clears throat> yeah, it's haunted. But not in a scary, bad way. I never felt afraid. I, I just knew I was not alone in the house. So, there's your bit of useless trivia or information that you didn't really need. But there we go. I am loving these. I love that they're not uh, bright um, primary reds. They're just, they're these burgundy kind of cinnamony reds. That one's upside down, but we'll give it a break. It's beautiful. Still, the, the um, greens are still my favorite. Or fall. They called it fall. But I think some of these would work in there with that fall, too. <laughs> the brain coming up with ideas. That's cute. Like a little box. Little starries. Okay, this is the first one that I can say, eh, I'm maybe not 100% in love with that one. 
it's got a pl I mean, it's okay, but it, it's not not a hundred percent in love. So there they all are. Fall, blue, red, yummy. So good. Okay. So this is the giveaway portion. I also bought this book, Pillow Talk. Um, I love pillows. Love making pillows. Uh, it's got all kinds of <laughs> isn't this cute with the with the bug. Um, I looked through here, and while I love them all, many of them are applique, and I honestly don't love applique. Um, so I'm gonna give this book away. Um, it's got some really beautiful stuff in it, but I I don't see myself making that. So I was also purging again, and uh, this is the Tula 100 Modern Quilt Blocks, and I have two of these. So uh, this is kind of like the uh, the box with the quilt blocks. Um, there's just, you know, she gives you a block and you go forth and, and make it. So, and someday I really do intend to go through here and use up all of my Tula scraps. But anyway, there's that. And then finally, I have this little um, cottage keepsakes book. Um, I've had it for quite a while. It has a lot of really cute stuff in it. Um, but ag again, most of it is uh, applique and or wool. And uh, it's just, it would be better served in someone else's home. So three book giveaway. Uh, we'll talk more about it in the next camera. I'll see you in a minute. So who knew? I am now a convert of uh, beautiful reproduction fabrics. <laughs> you know, when I think about it, I, I mean, I've docented, docent, I have been a docent in several uh, historical homes and I have always loved them. I love an old house. Uh, maybe it's been in there all along and I just, I just didn't know. So anyway, uh, the giveaway books, um, information will be down in the description box. You send me an email, um, in the subject line, put books and, um, $10 shipping. They can be yours. So, um, I've got, uh, another, I'm going to film another video after this one. And it's an, it's, yeah, it's a new something that I, I had not, it's new. <laughs> Spit it out. So uh, we'll say goodbye to this one. Be well, be safe, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.